Hey there, if you're a fan of Father Ted like me, you know it's one of the funniest shows from the 90s. So, let's take a trip down memory lane and see what the cast has been up to since then. We'll look at their names, how old they were back when the show was on, and what's going on with them now in 2023. Let's start with Father Jack Hackett, played by Frank Kelly. Back in 1995, he was 57 years old. Sadly, Frank passed away at the age of 77 on February 28, 2016, in Ireland. <laughs> that you're recording has given her much pleasure over the Christmas season, etc., etc., um, signed by a lady in waiting. So there you are. Isn't that nice? Yeah. It Majesty gets actually. great pleasure. Then there's Father Dougal Maguire, played by Ardal O'Hanlon. He was just a kid at 30 when the show started. Today, he's 58 and still filled with cheer. Ah! What is it? Ted? What is it? Did God write back? No, he didn't. Bollocks, anyway. Can I stand up and show you? So it's sort of like they're all fighting there and Dougal is looking on and he's really kind of, he's really kind of shocked and then he sort of looks around and then he just goes over and he just kicks someone. Dermot Morgan was the star, playing Father Ted Crilly. In 95, he was 45. He brought so much laughter to people, but unfortunately, we lost him too soon. He passed away on February 28, 1998, at age 45 in England. Father Bigley. <laughs> anyway, if you ever meet a woman, I'm sure you'll be able to deal with it. Just be yourself, Dougal. Be yourself. Make them feel at ease. And forth. There's this real sense of, of the empire. You still remember the empire. It's all these statues everywhere and these, these grim faces, you know, up in uh, Hyde Park corner. Graham Norton appeared as Father Noel Furlong. He was 33 back in 1996 when he joined the show. Now he's 60 and has been making audiences laugh for years. What are you doing here? Well, actually, this is our caravan. <laughs> Father Roth said we could use it. Yes, I see. I think you must say it to everyone. Hey, you lot, room for two. Uh, so now, now I'm here, and you know, you can go to see shows, there's yep. galleries, they deliver things, it's <laughs> easy to get a cab. It's old people fun. And if you are an older thrill seeker. Pauline McLynn brought Mrs. Doyle to life. She was 30 and 95 and has reached the age of 61 now, still bright and bubbly. Oh, there's nothing nicer than a cup of tea in the afternoon. You look a bit different, Father. Have you had a haircut or something? No, I'm... also believe uh, that we got the word feck, um, yeah. which, as we know, is not the bad F word. Yes. Feck into the Oxford English Dictionary. Oh. John Kenny played various characters, including Fred Rickwood. He was 38 during the show's run and is now 66, still active and doing well. I'm gumshit. Yes, he was going mad because of the film. Aye, and he told us to come down here and kick up a bit of a fuss. All right, yeah. Oh, but there's only one thing, though. Uh, you're sort of uh, disrupting the show. Another performer took up the script, there would be a different then there, because I think everyone brings something different to the table. So, yeah, there's a, there's a lot of... Uh... Don Witcherly portrayed the character Father Cyril Macduff in a sitcom back in 1995, at which time he was 28 years old. Presently, he is living a happy life at the age of 56. Train this year? Ah, you're a song 96. <laughs> the old fellow has been driven mad here with it. Anyway, we thought we'd enter it this year. Why don't you give it a go as well? I'm sure you'd win it. <laughs> no, 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 father, no, no. Uh, young uh, father. Yeah. <laughs> so they've aged you down for this. They have. Uh, yes, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I play the, uh, I play the young father. In 1995, John Oya took on the role of Patrick Drury in a sitcom at which time he was 50 years old. Currently, he is enjoying life at the age of 78. The shotgun and everything. <laughs> I wouldn't hesitate to use that now. If that man came in and tried to steal any of the whistles I have in here. He is uh, pretty much a central character in the drama, and uh, the story is very much involved with his rise to power and then his eventual demise. In 1995, Niall Buggy played the character Henry Sellers in a sitcom when he was 47 years old. As of now, he is living happily at the age of 75. Uh, Mr. Sellers, <laughs> how old are you? <laughs> don't, go, don't be asking Mr. Sellers how old he is. Ah, uh, that's quite all right. I'm 37, Father. Coming over to see this new building, which is uh, quite a shock to quite a few of them, actually. 
I left when I was 21 years of age, <laughs> so, uh, but I was there for five, five years. Five, and we can't forget Pat Short, who played Tom. He was 28 when the show aired, and now at 56, he's still entertaining folks. Hello, Tom. <laughs> Tell your lad, uh, did you get them here all right? I did, yeah. I got to film a bit of the island first. They'll be back soon. Right, so I'll just wait in the field, so. <laughs> and then get out of there. Oh, right, right. Okay. So his, his trick was, and it was the most amazing thing. What he did was he waited till the coffin was coming out of there, <laughs> sent the back, just outside the church, you know. About... Jim Norton as Bishop Len Brennan was a sight to behold. He was 57 then and is still going strong at 85. How's the son? <laughs> the son of God! How's the son of God? How's everything in the world of religion? <laughs> The world will do for religion. What the hell are you talking about, Krilly? Tony Guilfoyle had us in stitches as Father Larry Duff. He was 36 in the sitcom, and now he's 63 and doing great. <laughs> Lastly, Doreen Keogh played Mrs. Deneen and was 74 when she appeared on the show. She lived a long life before passing away at 93 on December 31st, 2017 in Ireland. Well, they think so. They're keeping her in for tests. <laughs> well, you know what happened to old Mr. Sweeney. Some young fellas. Who's your favorite from Father Ted? It's always a bit sad to think about the ones we've lost. Drop a comment and let me know your thoughts. And hey, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more, and ring the bell so you won't miss my next video. Thanks for watching.